Hi guys, it is Canada Graphs here. This will be a set report for um, The Flash. Season 9. Finally into the final season of this uh, series. This is episode 1 of the season. Um, and here we have uh, Grant Gustin on set. You can see Candace Patton down below to the right of that machine. Um, Grant is standing up on top of a flatbed truck trying to hold this machine in place or do something with the machine. Never quite got clear exactly what it is uh, he's supposed to be doing, but you can see he looked exhausted at the end of it. He's just like, oh, enough of that. And so he goes to the edge of the stage. I don't know what happens after that, but like he does this and uh, at some point he gets down off the stage, but not during this take. In this take he decides he's going to start doing a dance routine for Candace, and you can see her down at the bottom having a good time, having a good laugh at it. So here again, you see him doing the same scene. This time, does he get off the stage this time, or is this just a short cut? No, I don't think he gets off the stage this time either. One of these times he does get off the stage, whether or not I... I got that one on video I don't remember anymore um, this was several days ago most of you have probably seen the photos obviously by now of Richard Harmon as the new Captain Boomerang but here is some video of him uh, in the role um, if this is news to you uh, I mean I guess I guess you're just not uh, following a lot of the stuff going on with the show because there was even like official sources confirmed it the day after uh, I posted my photos of him. Um, well, here's Grant and Candace doing a scene and they... I'm, I'm across the street by the way, obviously on a five, uh, five or six lane street, so lots of traffic in my way unfortunately. Not much I could do about that. The side of the street they're filming on, they had locked down from uh, people being able to walk by. So unfortunately my only view was across the street over all of these vehicles so that's what you that's you know what you got to deal with sometimes um so yeah you can see them doing this scene where they're kind of like all emotional after whatever it was they just did you know they're uh having a hug and all that so here we see candace and in a moment the director's going to come out talk to her uh vanessa paradis i think her name is if i'm wrong i will try and correct it in the thing but I think that's her name um, and then uh, Candace gets ready to uh, do the scene and this is the scene she was doing <clears throat> she's just holding up a gun so she like, just walks away there after doing the scene and Dan and Grant starts doing his like little dance stuff again um, I mean I've told you guys this a lot of times in other videos he does dance a lot on set this is the scene she's just kind of like points the gun at something which you know we now know as Captain Boomerang and uh, Barry standing there with her. I don't know why they're doing this together. I don't know if there's a particular reason that Iris is on location with Barry while he's facing a villain. Um, I mean, obviously, she's got the gun, so maybe there's a reason that the gun was needed. And logically, it makes the most sense for her to have the gun since she's probably the only person on the team that's ever used it. So, I guess, you know, it does make some sense. Yeah, assuming the gun actually has a purpose and she's not just there with a gun trying to defend herself with that thing. <laughs> um, we'll obviously have to wait for the episode to figure out uh, why. But here is how far away I was trying to shoot that scene from, so now you have half an idea. They had a big fence all the way around the entire set, so everything was through a fence unless you were high enough up to look down on it so there's Richard again getting ready and you can see all the boomerangs laced on the inside of his jacket there <clears throat> he just had rows of them and he takes one out and you can see he goes to throw it in the direction where the flash would be standing if you see some of my uh, still photos from that set you actually see a scene where Grant standing on the ground for uh, that scene um, yeah so uh, here here now are some still photos from that day uh there was some cord industry uh pieces around there was this and then there was a a, a truck there 
um, the scene the scene was supposed to have like the cord industries driving that piece of technology on a flatbed truck so that's kind of why some of that stuff is around there um, here's a couple of photos of Candace from the day just uh, in between scenes you know getting ready to uh, shoot the scene she did there here she is uh, holding that um, uh, big gun that um, we've seen in the past and I can't remember the name of it but I am sure somebody in the chat will remind us of the name of it soon enough there's Grant um, his hair a little uh, shaggier than usual on this day um, here he is obviously either in scene or just about to shoot because he's got the cowl up um, here he is uh, he, he puts his uh, um, hand up to his ear uh, like he's getting a message from maybe uh, Chester or something back at the lab I don't know um, here he is with the machine you know just holding it still making sure it doesn't go anywhere last thing you want is inanimate objects just wandering off so there he is doing that scene where he is holding it still for whatever the reason is. Um, you can see Iris below there standing looking concerned. Um, just hanging out. Um, I, don't know I don't know enough of the details of the scene to know why she was there in the field at that moment. I mean we know she obviously has the scene where she's holding the gun which to be fair in the current team flash i think she's the only one that might know how to operate it so maybe that makes sense but <clears throat> here here they are doing the scene where they're hugging each other um i don't know what was so dramatic that they they needed to do that afterwards but uh i guess i guess it was really intense and they they felt the need to do that there um there they are you know doing the scene with the with the gun here she is having a laugh afterwards i don't know what he said or did but got a chuckle uh and there's uh richard Harmon with uh that big machine um yeah he 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 was the first person i saw when i got to set that day i didn't hadn't seen grant immediately they had richard up there doing um or not necessarily even Richard. It might have actually been Richard's double because they were dressed the same. But when I first got there on the day, the first person I saw out on set was either Richard or his double standing beside the machine. And I didn't know who it was yet. But um, first, first photos I took of the day, th those were of Grant and, and Candace. But uh, when I first got there, they had Richard standing up there. And I didn't know what was going on yet. So, Or his double. Again, I, I don't want to be uh, misinforming anyone on what I saw. Uh, here's Richard holding this mystery green thing in his hand which was in that machine and I am sure has something to do with uh, why he's uh, trying to steal this machine. Um, the machine has a name and I forgot. I don't know if I said it in the video part of the video because I edited the audio for these photos long after the fact so um, but it does have a machine. If I did not remember to put it in the audio part, I will put it in the uh, comments down below after the video goes up. <laughs> but uh, the machine does have a name. I remember that. Here's the scene where you see him do the uh, throw of the boomerang. You see him, he's selecting his boomerang out of his jacket. He is uh, now uh, in the process of getting ready to throw it. You can see it up in his hand there. And then, uh, yeah, he uh, chucks it, and the uh, Flash has to look like he's ducking out of the way of it. I don't know if he gets hit with it, but that's all I have for now. Hopefully, I'll have more video for the Flash in the near future, but as of right now, that is all I have for the Flash. They haven't been on location very much lately. And the one time they were, it was on a private hotel, so... Hopefully more soon, but that's it for now. Thanks, everyone. See you next video whenever that is. Bye.